This right here. <laughs> this stuff has to stop, all right? I thought we was done exposing children, all right? Now, me personally, I, I'm not here to bash the parent or the mother, should I say, because say mother puts her daughter on uh, on blast on Instagram Live for being a thought, okay? If y'all don't know what a thought is, it's just a new generation word of a slut. Um, excuse my French. It's not really a cuss word, but a hoe. Or a tree shot. Yeah, that, it's just all basically a person, a cheater. A person that's just out here. She's just busting it open for the crowd. You feel me? Just busting it open for everybody's son. That's what it is, okay? So look. Now, I've seen a couple videos in the past on these same type of situations. Now, like I said, I'm not here to bash the mother of this of this person. I'm not here to bash the mother that's in this video, okay? But it's just getting out of hand to the point where it's like, bro, parents, y'all have to stop embarrassing y'all kids on live, on the internet, because now y'all looking childish y'all self. Y'all just like a normal, a normal teenager. Every teenager that has a breakup or every teenager that go through something, what they do? Run to the internet. You can't do that with your kids. You have to actually sit there, talk to your kids, or discipline your kids behind closed doors. Don't put it on Instagram Live. Don't put it on Facebook Live. Don't put it on Snapchat, Twitter, MySpace. Don't do it. It's pointless. Now, look, we're going to go ahead and get to this video, man, because this is ridiculous. The mother is childish in this situation, and the daughter, she just looks so embarrassed, and this is how kids start to have those suicidal thoughts because of things of this, things like this. This is why a lot of kids kill themselves. This is why a lot of kids run away from home. This is why a lot of kids just do a lot of different things but be at home with their mother or their father or any type of parent guardian because of situations like this. Now, the mother was really childish in this situation, really, really childish. Like, it was just to the point where I was disgusted. When I watched this, I was disgusted. Y'all probably seen this already. I don't know, but I'm disgusted. I know my my supporters, my real supporters, y'all will be disgusted too. So let's go ahead and get into it, man. Um, mother puts her daughter on blast on Instagram live for being a thought, aka a Trisha, aka a hoe, aka a, a slut, or whatever you want to call it. So let's go ahead. Because I was sending people. Who naked who was you sending naked videos to, Saya? Terrell. And who else? Who you having sexual conversations with, Saya? Talking about sucking dick, skipping school. Say it. Tell them. Terrell. Terrell. This is the point right here. This is where it's just like, bro, your mother, <laughs> like the mother in this situation was, it's just stupid. You exposing your daughter on Instagram live, but not only exposing her, you making her say the names of the people that she sent it to. That's just the most, uh, like, not only is that exposing her, you exposing the boy too. Like, sometimes parents wonder why the kids act the way they act, but you can't lie. Every every mother, every father done did the same thing their daughter doing now or their son doing now. So, it's to me, I feel like if my son was out here sending nasty pics or if my daughter was out here sending nasty pics, I can't be as mad because I did the same thing when I was 14, 15. We all did it. We all did it. You can't be a hypocrite from things that you used to do in your teenage years. All you can do is talk to them, tell them what that would get them, tell them how they can get exposed. Because trust me, I'm I'm in high school and I promise you, don't freshmen, boy, they got exposed. I'm talking about the second week of school, my guy. They got exposed. I'm talking about they made a whole school exposed page for the freshmen, sophomore, junior team. Like people got exposed. Their body was leaked around the school. Sex tapes was leaked around the school. So that's all you could do is talk to them instead of exposing them on Instagram Live because now it's just like now she might have suicidal thoughts when she go to sleep at night. Now she might want to kill herself because now if you exposing her and the dude on Instagram Live and she go to school the next day, now she's a topic. She's a topic for the week. She go die down. It's going to die down in about like, you know, four, maybe three days. But she's a topic. She's a topic for tomorrow. Who? Allen. Okay, from where? They used to go to Kettering Middle School. Okay, and what else? What else, Sia? Why won't you be at the dance tomorrow? Because I what? I was sending somebody naked pictures of my body. And because what else? And talking like a slut. And because what else? What's this in my hand, Sia? Are a you phone? supposed to have a cell phone? No. Why? Because I already got it taken last year. Why? Why? Why you get it taken? Doing the same thing. Same thing pictures. like what, Sia? Tell everybody on your Instagram that you're not supposed to even touch a cell phone, right? Yes. 
Why not, Saya? Let the whole, let all your friends know. All of them, because they, here they go. They logging in. Tell them what's up. Bro, she got people on this live laughing. Laughing, bro. This has to be the most embarrassing thing a mother can honestly do. Not only is you embarrassing your daughter, you're embarrassing yourself. You're supposed to be adult in this situation. You're supposed to be a mother. A mother for a reason. A mother don't go out and expose their daughter on Instagram Live. A mother don't do these childish things. This is what a friend would do. Uh, a so-called friend would do. A mother supposed to be there, comfort their kid like, okay, you send the news, you know you're not supposed to do, you know this wrong, now there's got to be consequence behind it. Now I got to punish you. Now I got to take your phone. Now I got to do these type of things. But now you took it to the next level to go on Instagram Live and expose your daughter for something that she done did. Probably something that you done did when you was her age. You can't be mad because we all done send news. We all done did nasty things at 14. Like, you know what I'm saying? Like, me, I wasn't having sex at fourteen. Like at fourteen, I was just trying to figure out how to bust a nut. I mean, let me, let me, let's be honest. But some people, like some people, do things like this. And the reason I say this is because when it comes to having a kid, you gotta treat your kid as a prize, like a a present, a prize, bro. I put it like that, a prize. Because honestly, a lot of things that teenagers do, or a lot of things that younger kids do. They get it from their peers around them, and they get it from what's in the household. If you in the household doing crazy things around your kids, I'm talking about she can hear you getting your cheeks clapped in the next room. I'm talking about huh, 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 knocking no ankle loose, baby. She probably hear that next door, so she probably won't know what's that feeling. Or she probably be around friends that talk about sex because, let's be honest, sex is normalized now. It's normalized. It's really normalized in today's society, in today's generation. Sex is normalized. You can... Being gay is normalized. So, really, you just got to ask yourself what's really going on in school, what's really going on with your friends, and what's really going on in the household that could be changed around. But this right here is just like, this is a whole nother level of embarrassment. Because I was taking naked pictures of myself. Yeah, tell them why you sitting here popping your nails off that you just got done today. Because I got in trouble. Tell your friends, I'm all of them, somebody. everybody go to school tomorrow at Kettering Middle School and show this video of Asaya because it's going to be up. The police is here. She get ready to get locked up. Tell them, Asaya. Because I sent somebody. Act like, that, act like that little slut that be, on, that, that be twerking in the videos. You called your daughter a slut, and why is she getting arrested for sending news? It's not like she committed a crime. Like, come on, man. You just being childish in this situation. Like, who who really the adult? Your daughter or you? Let's be real. Who really the adult? Because right now, you acting like a 14-year-old, and she's acting more of an adult because she's more calm. She's not crying. She's just more calm and chill and relaxed. She's embarrassed, but she's more chill and relaxed. You over here. Tell them. Tell them, Saya. What, what did you do? The police is here. You popping up them nails. You sent these news to Terrell. And... Like, come on, bro. Come on, bro. You too old for this. You probably like in your 30s. 30s. Grow up, man. And that's why I say a lot of people can be older physically, but mentally they could be like the most dumbest, slowest. Sorry, that was wrong to say, but they could be they can be like a little mental thing. They could be physically 30, but mentally they could be an eight-year-old. Like a lot of people could be 40 years old but have an eight-year-old mentality. I'm glad I'm 18 physically, but I have like a older man, an older type of guy mentality mentality did i say that right i think i said that right come on and who was the boy that you was messaging talking about he sucked your titties who was that boy sire terrell the same one how many others is it sire that was not terrell i remember the number it was not terrell she just came up with that name that's why and, and what about oh. the one named justin what school he go to that's the one who did it oh. that's the one um justin. no who, who you send it to you that was justin it. right Yes. That was yes. Justin, right? Yes. That yes. was Justin. 10% low battery. Come on, man. Yes. That yes. was Justin, right? You, you yes. said he go to your school, right? No, Justin. Didn't no. he just say he go to her school? No, that's Jacob. That has oh, so that's Jacob. Uh, it's so many of them, Saya. I don't even know what to say. Which one is it this time? You such a damn whore. Which one is it this time? That's, that's like crossing the line right there. Calling your daughter a whore. That's honestly when you when you look at this video, it makes you disgusted because this is the mother speaking, not no sister, not no friend, 
This is the mother, the one that pushed her out, her cuckoo, her cooter mother, her cooter mama. Did I just say cooter mother? Her cooter mama. You know what I'm saying? And you talking to your daughter like this? And I guarantee, I guarantee, I bet you a thousand dollars right now that the mother did the same thing at her age. But yet she acting so like, she acting so, I don't know what. Like, dog. I mean, yeah, it's something wrong with your daughter sending news to other people, but you can handle that behind closed doors. You can handle that in your household. Now you bring the internet into your household. This generation is so messed up, bro. They go to the internet for every single thing, bro. They get into a breakup. They go to the internet. They mother die. They go straight to the internet. Like, come on, dog. You got to like, you gotta handle stuff behind closed doors. You got to be adult about some things. And this right here is not being an adult. This is being a very much child, bro. So all your friends know, well, I'm pretty sure you already known at school as a whore anyway, right? That's what they know you as, right? Bending your ass over twerking like a slut, right? That's what you known as, right? That's what your homegirl said, right? Her friends probably think it's cute. They probably do the same. That ain't your homegirl. If your homegirl said that, that ain't your homegirl, bro. Same thing. Hmm. Except Shania. I don't never see Shania in nothing. Shania probably the only decent friend you got. Yeah, ghetto ass Rachel. All the other ghetto ass little girls you hang with. You got a video of who was that fighting? That was on there. Janaya. Yeah, Janaya. Tell, tell Janaya, Janaya. Tell Janaya how, how you came home and talked about how she got beat up. Her and her friend, right? You came home that and told was... that, right? But then you come home and tell me and Brittany how Janaya and her friend got beat up over a boy. That's what you said, right? Yeah. Yeah. That's what you said, right? Yes. Now she exposing her for being a fake friend. Ain't no way, boy. Ain't no boy. I would have been mad, boy. I would have, man. I would have forgot that was my mama for a minute, boy. I would have started swinging, boy. I would have hit her with the haymaker, the haymaker, the haymakers. Hit her with the Mayweather. You feel me? Hit her with the Mayweather 2000 combo, cause boy, ain't no way, boy. You exposing for being a fake friend. Oh no, nah, now we got to scrap, mother. Now we got to scrap, boy. It's it's hello. It's go time. Kee kee, boy. I'm man. Now we got a scrap, dog. <laughs> oh, nah, bro. And you was laughing, kikiing about it, right? But that's supposed to be your homegirl. But you come here telling everybody how she got beat up. Ain't her homegirl. <laughs> Ain't nobody her homegirl. But I see why you don't have no friends because look at the shit you do. Oh. You can't even respect yourself as a as a as a young lady. You gotta put. That's. I agree on that. I do agree on that. And this is why I agree. Because I feel like every young lady should really respect their body, respect their... Because this is why I always tell a woman. When I date a woman and they say, and you know, I do have that question of, are you a virgin? That's just a simple question. That's just like a question I feel like everybody done asks. You feel me? Now, it don't matter if you are or not. But when they say yes, I'd be like, okay, keep that for the right man. That don't mean that I'm the right person. That don't mean that the next guy will be the right person. But you would know who the right person, but not just keep it for the right person, but keep it until marriage because that's the best way to do it. Because now if you do it outside of marriage, now you got a soul tie. And now you've connected with a person that you're not going to be with for the rest of your life. You feel me? So really, I could really say that. And I do agree on that, bro. You really have to respect your body. Respect your body because with all costs, like, that's what you really need to do, especially as a woman. Dudes, boy, they go slaying that little pee-pee around to the day they die. Boy, they finna, boy, they don't care. They don't care. But with women, yes, respect their body because, dog, uh, you, it's worth it. Like, it, I'm telling you, you will, you will thank your mother for saying that. That's one, the one thing that she probably was right on is respect yourself as a young lady, for real. Because all dudes go wrong nowadays, especially this generation, boy, they just trying to hit it and leave it. Hit it and leave it, boy. You know what I'm saying? They hit it and leave your coochie with some dust inside of it. it, it that's just how the generation work. But, yeah, come on. Put yourself out there like you that some girl, slut. You know, come on, that girl Shania ain't nobody friend. She fake. And I told Shania to stop messing, stop, stop hanging out Shania, with her. Shania, the only real friend she got. That's it. And I've, I've always told you that. Always. I've always told you that. Yeah, you want to still be around Shania. Why? Mm, you still hanging with her? Me and Janine are not friends. So you, right. are you still hanging with Rachel? Is she on your no. Instagram? Hmm. So, okay. so why they air drop the fight to you? Because if that you was Shania's, Shania's sister got into a fight with Janaya. 
Shania older sister It don't matter. It don't matter. Why are you even out there? Why? You ain't even supposed to be out there. She's not supposed to be out there. Then why? How did she get out there if she's not supposed to? So it's only two things that I can say from this answer or from that question or from that statement. One, y'all not really keeping an eye on her. <laughs> two, y'all don't care what she at because how did she get out there if she's not supposed to be out there? Or she could have lied and said she was somewhere. Okay, that could be worse. She could have lied and said, oh, yeah, she at this house, but really, not. okay, that could work. Okay. What, outside? Yes. I Janaya, and, and I guess that was Gabby fighting. And, and and I guess you asked Shania to airdrop you to fight or whoever was out there. Oh, airdrop. Or she probably was out there recording it and waited till she got on Wi-Fi. No, no. Somebody airdropped it. Well, either way, either way, she got to fight. Whether she whether she recorded it or whether somebody airdropped it to you, like you claim. And how long you had this Instagram? Because we went to New York three weeks ago. Yeah, so I had about weeks, at least about a month. Because she only got sixty followers. Who's on here now? Don't touch this phone. I was trying to see who's on it. You can look right there and see who's on it. But that person don't be on, can't be on Who's this watching your live right Nobody. now? Nobody. It's not zero people. Okay. Well, we just. Y'all just seen a mama, right? She, she doing all this yelling, all this talking, and her wig is crooked. Ain't no way, boy. Ain't no way, boy. I, man, man, I would have got that was my mom, boy. I would have snatched that wig off so fast, dog. I would have snatched it and ran with it. Ain't no way. Just gonna wait because everybody will see this tomorrow, won't they? How long will it stay on there? It'll stay on there for 24 hours. Okay, so everybody will see it. What's the name on there? The Her Instagram name? name? Lil Saya Finsta Ho. Ain't that some shit? <laughs> no, no, no. No. Yo. Yo, I'm over here trying to read the name. <laughs> she, ain't no way, boy. I can't say. You. There's only so much I can say. I can't say you on this one, sis. Sorry, I can't say you on this one, baby. I can't say you on this one. Your name, your name got hole in it. I can't say you on this one, bitch. <laughs> that, 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 is some, that is some stuff right there. I can't say you on this one. Mama got it with that one. Mama got it. Mama got it, bruh. Spell it, Mom. L-L-U-L-S-A-Y-A. Yeah. 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 F-I-N-S-T-A. H-O. Well, she got that last part right. The last two letters right. Can you get that isotone so she can finish getting this nail stuff off of her? No, because because I'm on her live. Okay, that's enough. So you can let your friends know that they can have a happy school year because you won't be back. Let them know that. I won't be back at school. Oh, Why? Don't ask it like a question. Say it. Like no, a I won't. I no, won't look at the camera, Saya. I won't be back at school. Tell them why. Because I said Look at the camera, Saya, and talk louder. I mean, you won't be back. Cause, okay. Honestly, I would have been happy. I ain't got to go back to school. I just got to post on Instagram Live. I ain't got to go back to school. Oh, my kid, I'm off in the dance. You feel me? Yeah, I just got exposed on Instagram Live, but I ain't got to go back to school. So now I ain't got to be 10 times more embarrassed than in person than I was on camera. You feel me? Come on, mess up. Because I sense my neck and pictures of my body. But that's the only reason why? Lil Sia fenced the hoe. So you know you're a hoe. That's tough, bro. That's really tough. Anyways, man, I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Now, my thoughts on that video, like I said, I'm still disgusted that her mother did this. But, you know, I don't I don't sit here and try to, uh, what's it called? What's that word I'm looking for? Try to tell somebody how to parent. Because at the end of the day, I'm not a parent myself. But I know when I do become a parent, I just pray that my kids have some type of sense. Okay? Some type of sense. I pray they get it from me. 
because apparently her daughter ain't had no type of sense for sending no type of news, and her mother show sure ain't got no sense for doing this. So let's see. Common sense ain't always free, and common sense ain't always common because if her mother ain't got common sense for doing what she just did, her daughter ain't got common sense. Look at that. Two non-common sense people. <laughs> It all works out. You feel me? It's all worked out, and I and I'm for sure that the daddy ain't got no common sense either. You feel me? And the little and the sister in the background, you wear my blood. You supposed to be my. You feel me? You supposed to be my ride or die. You supposed to be my sister because I heard it say mom. So you know what I'm saying. So you supposed to be my sister. You feel me? But you want to take up for me? That's cool. It's all good in the hood. Anyways, like I said, man, I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Hit the like button, subscribe to the. Subscribe to the channel if you guys are new. Turn on post notifications. Follow your boy on all social media platforms. Without further ado, it's been your boy, The Pan. God bless. Stay blessed. Peace.